But first, new insight into a pastor accused of sexually assaulting a child, a former member of his church speaking out. Now, her story is just one of the disturbing developments in this case. We are also learning that Ronald Mitchell has been indicted on three additional counts in connection to the sexual assault of a then 15-year-old girl, bringing the total count now to four. Also tonight, investigators telling us 12 people were living inside that church when the alleged abuse occurred. Keith Garvin live now with details you'll see only on two, including an exclusive interview with a former church member. Keith? Dominique, Bill, we spoke to a woman who lives here in Southeast Houston whose sister is a longtime member of that church. In fact, she says the entire family used to attend that church until they had a falling out with Mitchell. But she claims that she hasn't seen her sister or her niece in 10 years now because of that falling out. You know, that really hurts our family because nobody in the family can talk to her. We can't see her. Or nothing. A family in fear for a loved one's safety after the arrest of a Montgomery County pastor charged with sexually assaulting a teenage girl. 57-year-old Ronald Wayne Mitchell remains in jail now on four counts involving a girl who was 15 years old at the time. Demetrius Ellis says her older sister Angela Edwards, a member of Mitchell's Body of Christ Ministry in Magnolia, has had no contact with the family for the past 10 years. She blames Mitchell, whom she says drew her suspicion years ago by constantly demanding church members money. I don't care if it's pennies, if you just got paid. He wanted. He don't care if your bills was due or nothing. He wanted your money. In the warrant served at Mitchell's home, which also serves as the church where members live, he allegedly raped the girl on numerous occasions there and at nearby hotels. Ellis is now concerned about her niece, whom she's never seen, because Mitchell, she says, has turned her sister Angela against her family. I want to talk to my sister. I need my niece checked on. My niece is 10 years old, because he better not touch my niece, because that's going to be a serious problem. And Mitchell was originally charged with one count of sexual assault of a child, but prosecutors added three additional charges, all related to that same young lady who is now 16 years old. He is still in jail awaiting a new hearing on those new additional charges. Reporting live from Southeast Houston, Keith Garvin, KPRC, Channel 2 News.